Hi, my name is Jack Marsh with Innovative IDM. Today I'd like to talk a little bit about how to set up and auto-tune a Skawa variable frequency drive. Users are often asking me when I'm talking to them and visiting them about how do I configure and get this thing running. The manuals, as you can see, can be quite large and intimidating, but it's really a very simple device that has very complicated uses if you wanted to make it that way. The easiest way to start is to get one of these cheat sheets that Yaskawa provides. There's one for the MicroDrive family, the V1000. There's a couple more for the A1000 family because it's a little higher featured. So there's more operating modes. But using the cheat sheets, it walks you through how to wire the motor, the three or four very simple parameters you want to use, and then the actual operation of setting up and auto-tuning. If you wanted a little more detail, you can always get the quick start guide, and in the quick start guide, there are very simple flow charts that you can use. Walks you through step by step what you need to do to get the drive up and running very simply. And if you needed to know everything possible about every parameter, there are the big, detailed, complicated manuals that'll tell you everything you need to know. If you wanted to get copies of the cheat sheets or the manuals, please contact us at Innovative IDM. Anyone you, anyone you talk to is going to be able to get you the information or get, to someone, get you to someone who can. If you want PDF copies, please go to our website at InnovativeIDM.com and download whatever you need. And remember, Innovative IDM is the home of the legendary customer experience.